she was delayed enough that it probably could have been the case. Ah, yes! A tree that's sleep. Oh, this fucking tree was creepy every time. Now I remember. Um, better than the tree in uh, Ages, who develops a crush on Link. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Legend of Apu, Majera's Ash. <laughs> that, joke's already, that, that joke's already been made. I do, I, um, I do have one question, um, John. How how have you played uh, Pokemon Y yet, or any of the Pokemon games you recently got? What? Have you played Have you played a uh, Pokemon Y recently? I played a tiny bit. I'm not that far. <laughs> I'm rock rules. <laughs> how, <laughs> how are you enjoying it so far? Eh. What you, What starter did you pick? Uh, Fennekin, because I'm just gonna play all Fire Pokemon. Because the only reason I even want to play it is because I want to play a gimmick character. Ah, play Nuzlocke as I'm, your initial run. <laughs> I'm playing Captain Planet, so I'm playing as Wheeler. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> I thought my friend actually suggested a good idea for a sort of Nuzlocke run. Uh, catch a Pokemon in like, you know, the standard catch a Pokemon uh, in a... In the first Pokemon you encounter in the route and you, uh, you can't catch anymore. Catch a Pokemon, then Wonder Trade it, and uh, what you get on Wonder oh. Trade is what you used. Uh, uh, Wonder Lock. You're talking about the Wonder Lock. Yeah. Um, Universal Giant said Worcester broke a world record tonight. Oh, nice. And well, I mean, Cal considering Man. how did he good... How uh, did he good? How good he did last time. Yeah. And Kelman, it is ordered. John just needs to buy a new 3DS. Yep. That should... I'll t I've told you what the question was. The CDI run during the bonus stream. That was last stream? The last... They were starting that when John ended, so we... I, I literally just told everyone to go watch that awful run. Not awful in the sense that the runner was bad. It's just the fact that it's the CDI Zelda game. Oh, actually, I wonder, um, how, I wonder how many people realized what I was doing on sense. purpose and thought that might have been an accident or didn't notice I was doing that at all. Move my laptop downstairs, uh, for, uh, bear rooms for a sec. Okay. So, John, actually, you have CDI games, right? Just not a CDI. I have a CDI. Oh. I thought you didn't. No, I got a CDI. What? Oh. Never mind. I just it doesn't it that? doesn't save. That's the problem. Ooh. The thing, uh, the joys about old technology, huh? Don't most CDI games you can beat in one sitting anyway? Uh, it's still a couple hours. Mm. Um, this is where the seasons are changing, correct? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Don't. Oh, do you have the? God. Do you have the? What's the spe specific weapon for this the game? The rod um, of seasons. Thank you. I believe you need to be the first dungeon to get that, don't you? Yes, you do. It's right before the second dungeon. <laughs> so wait, John owns CDI games and a CDI? And I'm pretty sure they meant Brad. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Surprise, Brad. Apparently you're my property now. <laughs> oh, God. That's what I thought when I said that, too. I, I kind of stuttered when I said that. I was like, wait. Whatever. Okay, I'm currently no, downstairs, the reason why so... If my internet I, cuts out, it's because uh, reception's really bad, but I don't want to be too loud for my family, so... Okay, that's um, fine. Not all. Someone asked, like, why I was I astonished you own a CDI and games? It's because for a while you didn't own a CDI, but you had games, right? Yeah. Because when Phil from the Speed Gamers sold his Z CDI Zelda games, I got them, but I tried to buy the CDI and I got, I got outbid on it. I bought so much stuff hearing that. <laughs> So many PC games. I have, a, I have a friend in college who likes to uh, buy. Uh, he bought a Famicom and he's been buying games for it. He's got Earthbound and uh, uh, Fire Emblem for it. Um, I own a PS4 controller, but not a PS4. So, <laughs> but <laughs> but that's because the DualShock 4 is a really good PC controller. I once, before I got my PS2, I bought a bunch of games for the, PS, uh, for the PS2 online. My dad was like, why would you do that? So when I get a PS2, the ga I, I won't get out, uh, those games I wanted won't be bought by someone else. Said, uh, said, games, said games were like Kingdom Hearts 2 and uh, Metal Gear Solid 2 among others. So I really want to make sure I had them by the time I got a PS2. I have a PS2 that I haven't used in a while. I should probably play a game on that soon. Probably Jack and Dexter 1 if I played anything. Okay, there's this Shit. one game. 
there's this one Sorry. game I've been looking for. It's called, um, I played this oh so long ago. And I cannot uh -huh. know the name of it. But <clears throat> I remember you were a ninja, a little small ninja, just like this cute, adorable ninja. Mini ninjas. And or teacup ninjas. No. It Aww. wasn't. It, I know it wasn't it. But it, you were a ninja. I always wanted to it, play that game. It, it was kind of. You were kind of a little bit of chibi, but I remember that. God, I I it, I want to say it was like something ninja. I I that's all I remember. I ninja. I'm pretty sure you're t you're talking about mini ninjas. I ninja. Those those are both ninja games. Are you talking about Ninja Turtles? No, it wasn't. Ninja are you talking Turtles. about Vanilla Ice? I I posted. Are you talking about Vanilla Ice right? singing a Ninja Turtle song? <laughs> no. Was it the one I just uh, posted chat in our Skype chat? Chat seems to think it's no, I ninja. it's not ninja. Seeing... It's. I... Is it I Ninja? Okay, give me. A, uh, I need. I need a. Uh, I'll look up I the image, image of the box art. Give me a sec. Uh, I got it. I'm on Amazon already. Nope. Are you thinking of Go Ninja? Go Ninja? Go. <laughs> go Was ninja. it like Namco? Yeah. And on the GameCube? Hold on, let me see. That's it. That's it. Holy shit! Fifty-five dollars for I Ninja? Wow. Used at six. Look at the used. Oh, okay. I was like, <laughs> I was like, I Ninja is not that expensive. <laughs> it's always important to look at the used, not the prime price on Amazon. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's the game I'm looking. For. Uh, I remember. Yeah, I've been I always to wanted to play Mini Ninjas really bad. Min would... Mini Ninjas what? was okay from what I remember seeing of it. Yes, yeah, so we got. It. Thank you, guys. John, you were great at AGDQ. Can't believe I forgot to follow during AGDQ. I... Oh, they're making fun of how I'm playing this game. That makes sense. Yeah, because I wasn't at AGDQ. I donated. That was it. I don't even know what game I would speedrun if I actually went to an AGDQ. Like... Ninja Gaiden. There's already better runners. Well, if we're gonna... I'm trying to think of another... Superman during the awful game. That that would probably be it. I would actually be willing to practice for that. And I believe that, I believe they already have someone they, who would run it though. You say you have better runners. Just admit that you have so many bad memories of that race you did in Ninja Gaiden. No, they do have. Um, they le legitimately do have better runners. Uh, yeah, the Ninja Gaiden world record's really low. Airplane hitter says speed run Kaizo. <laughs> I don't think that's happening. Nope. They have, I think they have run ROM hacks before, also, but it wasn't like a Mario ROM hack. Yeah, you're missing a key. I believe you can get one if you bomb a wall nearby uh, the room outside that one. I remember way too much about this game. I haven't played this game since it was new, so... Which is why I'm in, like, zero fucks given mode, which is getting my ass kicked. I better be careful. You got a half heart left. I know. Well, I guess I have to give one fuck at least. Uh, yeah... Uh, I think it's all the way... Th the key's in this room because it, yeah, it does the jingle. Yeah, I give you the jingle, and yeah, you just gotta go hit that switch. I need to kill that bat. There we go. Good to go. You, you're decent at Gunstar Heroes too, but ah, uh, but I'm nowhere near the world record. Is STA finally back to normal? I wish I could play, I I could play games as well as you guys. I definitely, definitely don't hey, know enough. Hey, back to normal. Let's look at this list. You can wow, Ninja Gaiden be in 12 minutes. Jeez. Yeah, like I said, the speed run for Ninja Gaiden pretty optimized. <laughs> Ninja Gaiden one's 12 minutes. Ninja Gaiden two is 11:20, and Ninja Gaiden three is 13:30. Was it tool Ninja... system? No, those are all real. Ninja Gaiden Black is an hour and 40. Um. Who holds the black <laughs> record, honestly? Black is on the Xbox One, and it's held by Josh Mangini. Not who the I thought it would be. I thought it would have been Shinobier. Unless that's Shinobier's real name. That might be. Because they don't... I don't think they typically use their nicknames. <laughs> that is interesting. What's up? Oh, a picture someone posted in the stream chat. It's another funny uh, old uh, cartoon Spider-Man one. 
No, 60 Spider-Man meme. Superman 64 yep. speedrun on this website? I swear to God, if there is. <laughs> there probably is. There, someone Superman actually doesn't... Superman 64. Yeah. An hour and 53 minutes. He's got all the uh, clipping glitches down pat, so... There is technically a faster way through it, but I don't know if it would be counted as legit or not. Because you have you basically have the switch difficulties to do it. Mm. But it also skips two stages. And the... I think all the rings, so... People are like, Xbox One or Xbox One? Did I say Xbox One? You said Xbox One. So they're asking, do you mean original Xbox or played on an new, Xbox new one? one? Ninja Gaiden Black totally is on the Xbox One. I'm not, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> original Xbox, Xbox, guys. I'll be nice. <laughs> Yeah, I'm never gonna get used to that. Uh, yeah, I got, uh, guys, uh, Darkheart, please don't, uh, post straw poll links. If you're not in VOD, please don't, uh, uh, post straw poll links. That's how we end up crashing the site. Yeah. That seems to happen on a regular basis. Yeah, guys, I, I know, I know you guys want to make jokes and stuff. I understand that, but we can't put any more stress on the, on the website itself. So that's why only mods are allowed to post straw poll links. We, so, we have broken that website before, just for references. Do you sake. realize what the description for Superman 64 says on SDA? What? What? Superman 64, released in May 1999, is one of the most infamously bad games of all time. It received negative reviews at release and was subsequently popularized by a certain YouTube personality. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm pretty sure they mean Angry Video Game Nerd. I'm pretty yeah. sure that's referring to Angry Video Game Nerd. Let's be, uh, on let's yeah. be honest here. I think, it was at I think that showed up on Cinemasker first, though. Before YouTube, I could be wrong. I'm like 100% sure they mean uh, Angry Video Game Nerd. Uh, well, you gotta. Well, there's also other. Live the dream, John. Live the dream. Oh come on. <laughs> Are people? Well, here's... I don't think he wants to live that kind of dream. Well, the thing is, though, I I kind of am interested because you actually got a developer for an interview, didn't you not, John? Uh, yeah, I got Eric Khan. Yeah, I was I, I was actually really interested when you in the beginning of one of your videos you kind of talked about like showed like your email conversations. I was actually really fascinated by it. No, like I I enjoyed like that aspect of it, but I just <laughs> Ace Ace Hunters. You know what game has been popular by John? Our Man Zero. <laughs> Act Zero. Good old Baz. Baz. I forgot that. You should only play. You should literally only play as the Baz in Dive Kick from now on. Though. No, because I suck as the Baz in that game. <laughs> I'm much better as like Kick or Shoals. Uh, what game? Dive Kick. Dive Kick. Oh, Dive Kick. I have not been able to play that yet, sadly. Dive Kick. Okay, just the boss left. All right. And, you want to and wall master. Down. Never mind. Nope. Meh. Well, I know what the shortest speed run on this list is. Mm. Clue. Clue. It's one. Yep. It's zero seconds. Actually, no. Pokemon Red and Blue is zero seconds. Wait, what? Because you you save glitch immediately, and beat the game by walking left. Interesting. Clue well, was one second. Oh shit! I wasn't. I was looking at a fucking chat. <laughs> well, I see chat calls disappointed. I think that calls for a disappointment. Yeah, that's a disappointed. Wait, they disappointed. You said oh shit, and they said disappointed. No, they said it because of the first wall master, and then now they will be saying it for the second one. <laughs> I was like, that's impossible, this amount of lag. Yep. Yep, they're, they're laughing. Did you see the new, um... The new... Glitch that... Rom Scout didn't find it, but he was practicing it last night in Soten. That you can beat the game in under 10 minutes now. Same thing the night? Yeah, you can manipulate the menus in the game to give you all the, uh, most of the relics that you need. What so game? you don't have so in Symphony of the Night Castlevania. Ah, uh, oh yeah. It is I know now being theorized you can beat that game in under ten minutes. 
by menuing. It actually, you glitch the memory in the game. The, the very basics. I'm not an expert in so You give yourself, you fill up your inventory entirely while you, you're already equipped with everything. And then you unequip something and it overflows the memory in the inventory. And then your relics menu becomes a visualizer for the music that's being played. Yeah. Wow. Which gives God. you the relics. Wow. There hasn't been a run with it yet, but Rom and the guy who found it and like Cosmo have theorized it could probably be under 10 minutes. Wait, John, did For... you actually play Disappointed? Yeah, I did. Oh, okay, the... I, did. I just didn't hear it because, you know, I got the stream muted. It is okay. one of... It, it amazes me. That game came out 17 years ago and a massive skip for the game was found, was found this week. So, um... So, Solar, what was the first item that was acquired? In what? You'll see. In this game. What's the first item? There's the scepter stuff, but, like, is there also a season two? Wait, what? Oh, oh, the, um, uh, the, um, uh, this game. Um, well, you, get the, you get, uh, once you get the run of seasons, if John plays far enough, uh... No, get... I'm, we're going cookie after this. We've been, okay. we're over time. Okay, also, but you, thank first, you. the first season you get is winter, and then in the second dungeon, uh, no, before that you get the shovel, which you use to uh, open the way to the second dungeon, and then you get the boomerang in that dungeon. Thank you, thank you, Blue Nix. Uh, for the guy's name who found the glitch was Sock Folder. No, not the, I... not the boomerang. You get something else. Oh, God, what did you get? I I grabbed a ring, but she dropped a potion as well. I know in the I know in the third in the third dungeon you get the the rock spider, which allows you to jump. Right, what is it? Oh, in that actual area I went into? The act, the actual, like, dungeon I went into? What? Mm -hmm. what? In the dungeon, I picked up the uh, bombs and the seed satchel. Oh, yeah, you picked up bombs. There's a chest, chest full of them. Okay. Frick, that's bugging me. I gotta check now. Uh... <laughs> well, while you do that, let's go to the cookie. Okay. It's time for the cookie. Really? You're, gonna, you're actually you're actually gonna do it? No. Only if you want me to, but no. other than that, no. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. All right, our choices for this time around in the fortune cookie are as follows: random. Okay, uh, I, I'm just gonna say what I found. Uh, the item you get in the second dungeon is the power burst, which allows you to hit lift heavy objects. Okay, cool. So it's just like a Link's Awakening. Yep. Okay, uh, our following games are, these are the following choices. Uh, Mystery Magfest game, Mystery Steam game, Mystery Arctic Scarab game, and the following three random games. That's an RPG. Wow, well, what came up? Uh, Dragon Warrior Monsters 2. Metal Gear Solid for the Game Boy Color. Oh, interesting. <laughs> Whoa, it came up twice! <laughs> <laughs> it can do that?! Uh, so we're just gonna just John, you that broke, doesn't happen. You broke backlog. Right? Twenty six hundred games and it came up twice <laughs> in a <laughs> row. <laughs> what? Oh, I can't wait! I can't wait to see the chat. <laughs> Duke Nukem Land of the Babes <laughs> <laughs> and Mc McPixel again. God, what is going on with backlog Jesus. today? <laughs> Area fifty one. I can't even do that. It's a light gun game. Jesus, what is going on with backlog tonight? Zombies ate my neighbors for Super Nintendo. Ooh. Oh, <laughs> zombies, zombies. I never got the chance to play that game. I really want to see someone play it. I didn't even know it could do that. <laughs> Apparently so. Well, surprise there. <laughs> and people were kind of, <laughs> people were kind of freaking out about Metal Gear uh, showing up twice. And they're accusing you of breaking fortune cookie. Now, of course, I don't blame them. Well, to be fair, I did too. <laughs> um, Alrighty. Zombies is a great game. Mm -hmm. Uh, still waiting on Dan to. Uh, There's Dan's there drop a link. Click on it and vote and see what game you want to play next. I'm, you know what? Uh, Metal Gear earned its <laughs> vote. I'm not surprised that's currently leading, but let's get it actually on camera proper here. Unsurprisingly, with 58% of the vote, double Metal Gear Solid for Game Boy. Followed by 21% for Zombies Ate My Neighbors. Duke Nukem Land of the Babes at 10%. That's not for the Game Boy, it's for PS1, but whatever. I don't think it's going to win. 
and all the Mr. Games are in the last three spots. Oh man, that's great. That's really free. Awesome. Uh, doesn't really matter. They're the bottom four. I was gonna say Mystery Games are switched around for me for oh. three and four. I only okay, one, well. one Mystery Game came up, and that was with Pixel. What was John? Sorry, I'm asking this, but what was the first game you played tonight? The one that you started the stream off with. Uh, the uh, time. Viking. Oh yeah, Time Viking and Space Velociraptor. Okay, because that game looked hilarious. I was like racing, funny but I had your stream up, so. Funny thing is, the moment you started playing, I just saw how crazy it was. I'm just, I just thought to myself, I have a feeling this is behind the guys I made. I made a game of zombies in it. It is. Yep. I, I actually started singing that to Gex when I saw like. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember. Like, I remember one time I went to a friend's house and he just, like, I just, we felt like playing. I wanted to play Left 4 Dead, but he said I, I had to have a different zombie game and uh, let's play it. I'm like, okay, sure. And we played that, and half the time I was just confused, wondering what the hell was going on. Yeah, that's the proper response to I made a game with zombies in it, really. <laughs> it's a good Fucking. game for like a dollar. That game's great. So, yeah. John, um, apparently Dan did the math. The odds of that happening was one in six million seven hundred and sixty thousand. Wow. <laughs> You beat those odds. Well, guess I should go buy a lottery ticket. <laughs> <laughs> you probably should take Tertuga with you just to be sure. Yeah, maximize that luck. Well, we've only got 770 votes, but um, Metal Gear Solid still has 47% of the vote. I think it's a safe bet. When we come back from break, we're playing Metal Gear Solid for Game Boy Color. Oh, good lord. And your Game Boy player is getting... Yeah. Do you have a Super Game Boy? Uh, no. Oh. Did, wait, what'd you use? What'd you use to uh, do you to the uh, Donkey Kong Let's Play? You did the uh, regular Game Boy, or uh, sorry, regular Super Game Boy. Uh, okay. Oh, I thought he, did, did you say Super Game Boy or Super Game Boy Two? Super Game Boy for the oh, SNES. Okay, no, I have a Super Game Boy, but I don't have a uh, I don't have a Super Game Boy Two. There's, There's a, a Super, Super Game Boy, Game Boy Two. 2. It never came out in North America, only in Japan. But I believe it had, it had support for, I believe, the... Uh, if not Game Boy Color games, then the... I can't even remember what the hell it added. I think it added support for, like, the Black Cart games if they were having issues or something like that. How are you guys, like... Okay, for those of you who live in Canada, I know John does, I don't know the other two. Uh, do you remember uh, View Game uh, Live Arcade or whatever it was called that was on YTV? Oh, Video Arcade Top 10. Yeah, that. Didn't they have some kind of Game Boy player for, like, the, the N64? Yeah, those were developers only. Uh, you can ah. buy them online. They, I think they work like the expansion cart, or, like, the, the transfer pack. So you could play game... That was the only Game Boy player before the GameCube one that could actually play Game Boy Color games proper. That was my dream to end up on that show. And supposedly there was a version that also played uh, GBA games on the N64, but I might be wrong on that. I, th I think you're right, actually. I think I seem to remember them playing uh, GBA games on the N64. I, I think so. I don't know. All right. We'll be back. We're going to be switching games now, and I'm going to go take right. a, quite, a quick stretch. Okay. And for those of you who are listening to us right now, if you guys want to ask me... Uh, uh, John. <laughs> <laughs> I, was having a I was having a brain fart moment. Solar Knight or um, NY Video Just Game Freak <laughs> or John for short or other John for short. Uh, go ahead. Today's not my night. I'm not gonna lie. God damn it! That's such a catchy song. What? I made a game with zombies in it. <laughs> it is. Oh god, RG Games there said, Hey John, I know you love bad games, so why not stream E.T.? Do you ever try streaming an Atari 2600? I'm pretty sure it's impossible. Yeah, that's also a point. Apparently Super Genius is currently streaming. We should totally raid him. Oh, let's do that. Uh, you're typing in the background. Well, yeah, I type a lot, sorry. Uh, let's see, what is he doing? Mm. That is his YouTube channel, not his uh, Twitch. Thoughts on tonight's stream. Very interesting. Uh, made... Thought, my uh, thoughts? Okay. I've been having a lot of fun. 
Uh, kind of hope I can do this again sometime. It's on God damn it. That song literally, that's the only words to that song, but it's, I love that song. It's the tune. It's totally the tune. He's that game is a dollar. If you don't own that game, get it. <laughs> uh, Super Genius is currently playing Spiral the Dragon. That's awesome, Puppet Master. That is awesome. Uh, RJ, mobile has been getting ads for me every once in a while. Um, I don't know. Mobile, I guess it all depends if you're iPhone or Android, but sometimes mobile's been getting ads. I typically watch a lot of streams on my phone when I'm going to bed, so I can turn off my computer. Question for all three of us: What are what are our guilty pleasure games? Ooh. Um. Well, I'm not sure if these would count, but pretty much the Magical Quest star in Mickey Mouse. Ah, mm. uh, shit. Um, I'm not sure if that would count as like a guilty pleasure because they're actually really good. Uh, I'll put that down. I went, to, went and said hi on, on Jake's stream. No one noticed. <laughs> oh, I'm trying to... I went and said hi on Jake's stream, but no one noticed me. Oh, well. Guilty pleasure game. I don't uh, know. Hmm. Dance, guilty pleasure game, Barman Act Zero. I wonder why. Fucking... <laughs> I think it was... I already forgot it. K had fucking streamed Bad Rats all day today. And then there was our race. Our race was fun. I'm terrible at Super Mario Galaxy, and you kicked my ass. Oh, you you were at least behind me by at least five. Seconds. I would say Sonic CD, but that kind of has a falling. Falling. Oh, yeah. Sonic C Sonic. Wait, Sonic CD. Well, I say that because I, a lot of times I hear people uh, say negative things about it. It's, it's Sonic CD as a bad game. Hey, I'm just going on what I heard. Uh, uh, okay. Okay. I just hear, I hear a lot of negative I, things. I, 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 I never heard of Sonic CD as a game. Though. Probably because maybe not a lot of people have access to it. My guilty pleasure game is the Call of Duty, like the newer Call of Duties. I love that multiplayer. It is uh, so fun to sit down and just bullshit like Black oh, Ops man. 2. For I can't play life. Call of Duty. I, I just, I, I don't I, I like the unbalanced multiplayer. I agree with you, John. Um, but for me, Call of Duty is like one of those games. It's really one of those genres that you could turn your mind off and just, just sit there for hours. Um, I, I, I but mean, technically, it depends who you're talking to. Then it's a guilty pleasure because the majority of people don't see it as a bad game. Yeah, King Dragio, I I agree with you. Shadow of the Hedgehog, that's my guilty pleasure game. I love it. But I just like sitting there and just having perks and weird shit happen in multiplayer. Do you? Pr do you particularly like the zombies mode? Like, or, or let I, me ask this. Do you particularly like Treyarch Studios' Call of Duties or Infinite I Wars' like Call of Duties? Treyarch's much better. Because yeah. Treyarch, at least the stories, I can also play and not be want to kill myself halfway through and be like, this is mm -hmm. boring as shit. Black Ops 2 had a pretty fun story mo mode. I heard Ghosts is pretty good, the story. Uh... But I think the only part my friends liked were the part where you're in space. I, that was for, cool. I don't know. I've, I've been hearing some mixed opinions. I heard, though, for their new DLC, um, for one of the maps called Fog, if you get a, a, a field order, which I have no idea what that is, you could actually play as Michael Myers from the original Halloween series. And John has been back for a while. He just Have you? Yep. He's got the game up. Oh, He's just waiting for a chance to say quiet. something. You're just being quiet, waiting for us to notice you? Yep. <laughs> I... Typically, shut up when you say something. Sorry. I'm just also I'm also trying to change the game here because that's why. Mm. Uh, does anyone remember what the actual code name of this game was? It was like Metal, Metal Gear Solid, Solid Ghost Babble. Metal Gear. I, wasn't it just titled as Metal Gear Solid? Metal Gear Solid. 
or Ghost Babble. Holy shit, John. John, when is more Superman just subscribed? Jesus Christ. Oh, man, that's not... John, when is more Superman? Thank you for subscribing. Here's your whatever the fuck's on...